When we started this journey in 2016, we set the goal of bringing transformative gaming experiences to all gamers across the globe. Gamers have different priorities and play styles, but we all want to have the same great gaming experience with the same catalog of next generation games that we can play with our friends regardless of which device we choose to play on. To deliver on our ambitions, we knew we needed to build two consoles with similar next-gen capabilities at a differentiated price point. By designing two consoles in parallel from the very beginning, we can deliver the same core gaming experience while also making it as easy as possible for developers to scale their games across both consoles with minimal effort. This means that Xbox Series S delivers the same incredible next generation experience and features as Series X, just at a reduced rendering resolution. With that in mind, I'd like to highlight some of the features and performance benefits you can expect from Xbox Series S, our smallest, most affordable, all digital next generation Xbox console. Xbox Series S leverages the same eight core Zen 2 CPU architecture as the Xbox Series X, running at 3.6 gigahertz and 3.4 gigahertz with simultaneous multi-threading enabled. The primary difference between Xbox Series X and S is the GPU. Xbox Series X is designed to deliver a next generation gaming experience in native 4K at 60 frames per second with support for up to 120 frames per second. Series S is designed to deliver the same great next gen experience at 1440p, also with support for up to 120 frames a second. It also includes an advanced hardware scaler to upscale your games when you're connected to a 4K TV. Xbox Series S also has full hardware support for AMD's latest RDNA 2 feature set, including hardware accelerated DirectX ray tracing, mesh shaders, and variable rate shading, the exact same as Xbox Series X. Xbox Series S contains 10 gigs of GDDR6 memory running at 224 gigabytes per second, scaled in line with the target resolution. Both consoles are powered by the Xbox Velocity architecture, which means you can expect the same next generation benefits from Xbox Series S, including faster load times, consistent and higher frame rates, and new features like quick resume. Xbox Series S advances the state of the art even further by adding new innovations such as sampler feedback streaming, only possible on our next generation consoles. With sampler feedback streaming, Xbox Series S is able to load only the portions of textures required to render the scene, just when they are needed. It allows games to load texture data with a much finer granularity than ever before, resulting in a massive leap in I.O. and memory efficiency. The Xbox Velocity architecture works in perfect harmony with our custom SoC to make this possible, including our custom NVMe SSD, dedicated hardware decompression blocks, our new direct storage API, and sampler feedback streaming. This enables, on average, approximately two and a half times improvement on IO bandwidth performance and memory utilization beyond the raw hardware specifications. Developers can use this improved efficiency to increase the amount of detail and texture variety or provide additional resources to other systems such as AI. This means that next generation games will load much faster, texture quality can be significantly increased, and quick cuts between scenes are now achievable, keeping the player immersed in the game world. Here, you can see how much more quickly games can load on Xbox Series S. The player on Xbox Series S is already enjoying the Outer Worlds, while the player on Xbox One is still waiting for the game to load. This is important not just when players launch a game for the first time, but every time. Whether it's time to load in a new level or restart from a previous checkpoint after a momentary setback, Xbox Series S gets you back in the game faster than ever. With Quick Resume, this is how easy it is to move from one pause game to another and pick up right where you left off. Suspend and Resume made it simple for Xbox One players to put their consoles to sleep and get back into the game later. 
With Quick Resume, Xbox Series S owners can have multiple games in rotation and easily move among them in a snap. As we said previously, we designed Xbox Series S to target 1440p at 60 frames per second with support for up to 120 frames per second. For a closer look at what 120 frames per second means for games, let's go over to our friends at The Coalition. When Gears of War made the move to 60 frames per second on Xbox One, players benefited from higher frame rate, fluid motion, and increased gameplay responsiveness, which is so essential for a precision multiplayer game like Gears. Yeah. We're excited to announce that with next-gen gaming on Xbox, Gears is taking a huge leap forward beyond 60 frames per second. With our update to Gears 5, we're bringing 120 frames per second multiplayer to Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S. At 120 frames per second, every reaction and input is translated to on-screen action even faster without compromising visual quality. The Xbox Series S is more than four times as powerful as the Xbox One S. It's certainly capable of 120 frames per second, and we've enabled that with Gears 5 without compromising visual quality. You really need to play it to feel how smooth and responsive the game is as your controls translate into gameplay with less than half the latency. This is so important for Gears, a game that requires precision aiming and shooting, high-speed cover movement, and Twitch-based player versus player battles. We cannot wait for you to experience the performance of 120 frames per second on both Xbox Series S and Xbox Series X. With Xbox Series X and S, your favorite games seamlessly scale across devices while maintaining what's new and innovative about our next generation consoles. We wanted to make the development process as easy as possible for developers around the world to build their games for both consoles. All the games you see here are running on Xbox Series S. Developers today already use a number of techniques such as dynamic resolution scaling to scale their games across multiple performance profiles. And the design of Xbox Series X and S empowers them to continue to do so without requiring fundamental changes. Developers will typically optimize their games first for 4K on Series X, and then scale down the rendering resolution to 1440p for Xbox Series S, while still supporting all of the other great next-gen features. With support for all of the same next-generation features and capabilities in both Xbox Series X and S, developers can focus on delivering the same great gaming experience on both consoles, and their power, speed, and performance will enable the future of games.